What's up guys? Wanted to talk to you about the uh, installing an aftermarket wheel. I got a new Momo competition wheel from their Black Friday sale. I installed it with the uh, Shorty wheel hub. This guy. Got it from OK Garage. Um, then I got the NRG half inch adapter. I just got that off of Amazon uh, just to clear this um, piece right here so I can get the horn and everything in place for the uh, the wheel. And that keeps everything nice and short um, so your wheel isn't kind of sticking way out here. Um, it actually might be a little closer to the controls than, than stock, so I might actually add a quick disconnect that would make it just a little bit bigger. <clears throat> but any way you do it, um, when you get the shorty hub adapter and you put it on here, it's not going to turn your... Uh, turn signal cancel ring and that's what this thing is right here um, so it, when your wheel is on there it gets pushed in a little bit and then that uh, there's a couple notches on here that activate a mechanism on this side that will cancel your turn signals after turning uh, I like that feature so I wanted to retain it um, so I made a little bit of, or made a, a, a ring adapter that will adapt your shorty hub to your turn cancel ring. So you can see it's got a bunch of different little holes on here. So no matter how you have your wheel clocked on here, it's going to uh, be able to be set up correctly. Um, like I said, you have these two little notches right here, one on both sides. When you put your steering wheel on with your new cancel ring, uh, you're gonna want the tabs to be facing straight up and straight down um, these are gonna like I said can't or use or they're gonna work with this mechanism to cancel your turn signals um, if they're not straight up and straight down if they're like off to the side a little bit then your turn signals will cancel earlier when you turn turn right than then when you turn left or, um, or or the other way around but one of the two uh, so you're going to want to just have them straight up and down. Just move that uh, ring. It's really easy to move. Just move it so it's straight up and down. Um, this ring I'm still developing, so it's a little bit loose around here right now. I'm going to make some ribs that go on the inside. That'll make it a little bit tighter to here. That way it'll stay on when you're installing your wheel. But for now, just for uh, demonstration purposes, um, that ring just slides straight onto there. It slots into these tabs right here. These tabs are offset in a uh, non-symmetrical way, so it only goes on one way. If you try to put it on that way, it's not going to work. That way is not going to work. has to be that way. So just do that. <laughs> you have plenty of slots here to, uh, to line up with your cancel ring when you put it on. When I took my wheel off, I marked the center of where I had it just with a sharpie uh, towards uh, this little notch that's in the steering column just so I can center it back up when I put it back on. Um, so for now I'm going to hold this ring and I'm going to put it on there, get it on the center, push it down. Now it's mated up with the cancel ring and uh, ready to put your wheel on. So it's pretty much that easy. <laughs> If you're trying to get an uh, aftermarket wheel and you have your stock wheel, then you can just uh, do this step while you do that. But if you already have your aftermarket wheel, uh, it might be a little bit more difficult. I had to use my uh, my three-jaw puller and I put it around each side of this adapter here and cranked it down until, uh, until this popped out. It took quite a bit of force because this is a press fit in there. So. Um, so yeah, if your wheel's already installed, there's a, you might have to get a puller or something to get that out. Um, otherwise, I'm gonna bolt my wheel back up. Or actually, I'm not. I'm gonna I'm gonna revise this part, and then I'm gonna print another, <laughs> and then I'll put that one on here, and then I'll bolt everything back up, and it'll be all good to go. So, thanks for joining me.